Abby, I'll just start by saying that I have prayed for this day your whole life. And just like I told Craig in the stairwell at your graduation, Charlie, the Lord answered every prayer, and He gave me more than I asked for. When we were young, we burned like summer suns. Our fears at bay, we made our own way. So about a day or two later, I get a call, and I was like, well, hey, how's your girlfriend quest going? He said, it's going awesome. Four girls have let me know that they like me. I said, well, that's pretty good. How do you stack rank them? He said, well, it's Abby and everybody else. I said, Abby who? Abby Holmes. And you called me and we were catching up and you said, well, I've met my wife. And I was like, you're a sophomore in college, but okay, let's take a step back. He said, we're not getting married tomorrow, but I'm done. We Thank you all for honoring us to be here to celebrate Abby and Charlie. It's just amazing and we're just so blessed to be here tonight and to have all of you as friends. I'm so excited for y'all and I can't wait till tomorrow. You're here. Charlie is one of the most loyal people I've ever met. We got a lot more to do together, but it has been an absolute joy to be your father. Really, Abby's been an awesome sister to both of us. She's always been there for us. I've always loved this girl. She's so confident, she's so kind. Abby knows exactly what she wants and she will do anything that she needs to do to get it. I, Charlie, take you, Abby, to be my wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. To love and to cherish you. To love and to cherish you. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Charlie, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and devotion. With all that I am. With all that I am. All that I have. All that I have. I promise to honor and to cherish you in God's name. I promise to honor and cherish you in God's name. Introducing for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Charles Bufkin. I look at the love that you two share for each other as a great example for how I should do it. I love them individually and I love them together. They are such a blessing to us all. Yeah, here's to Charlie and Abby, to a long, successful marriage and happily ever after. By the power vested in me as a minister of the gospel, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Charlie, you may kiss your bride.